Southwest Virginia expressing concerns about long wait times for emergency responders. Good evening, I'm Kristen Kwan. And I'm Casey Getz. News 5's Kylie Hill finds out why it can take sometimes much longer for emergency dispatch to arrive on scene. Tony and Garland Barton reside in Russell County, but their mom lives just across the county line in Buchanan County. After their mother had a medical emergency, the brothers called 911 dispatch. One night, her fistula port for her dialysis fell out. Two o'clock in the morning. I get her to Abingdon before they could even get Oakwood up to the council area. I called 911 back and said, don't even worry about sending her. I'm going to regard her in Abingdon now. The two say it wasn't the first time something like this happened. My mom's had a stroke May of this year. And every second council one has a stroke. You call 911, Oakwood's on their way. 45 minutes. They say, you need to get them out there in the air. But in royal areas like this, Buchanan County Chief Dispatcher Carrie Owen says it's not uncommon to experience lengthy wait times for help to arrive. They say the main issue is distance. There's quite a expanse of roadway from where the station may be located to where the patient may be, may be located. You know, you have travel time. Both Tony and Garland are looking for a solution. If they have to change it to a pay service, do whatever that has to be done. The people in that area deserve the same amount of coverage, both 911 and whatever. Owens tells me she empathizes with concerns from residents and says her team does everything they can to prioritize calls and provide adequate response time. You do the best you can with the abilities and the resources that you have. And it is very frustrating at times for residents when they feel like, you know, it's, it's a little bit longer than what they think it should be. In Buchanan County, Kylie Hill, News 5, WCYB.